<clears throat> what's up guys j back doing another con uh, all unboxing and this time we got more batman i think it said asriel batman man bat uh, <clears throat> gonna pull the listen up a lot of 45 vintage dc it says batman superman asriel man bat uh i'm only paid 44.94 the lot it's 45 comics so it's you know basically a dollar a comic Right under a dollar. Um, yeah, so pretty decent deal. I mean, kind of right at my break even. Pretty much right at my break even. So we'll crack it over and see how see how accurate the lot was. Silly. That's uh, P A Robert one P A R O B E R T one. Oh, man, I hate it. Packing peanuts really on some comics. That's stupid. That's really stupid. I hate people that shit packing peanuts. Yo, that's for real. I'm giving him an F just for that. <laughs> yeah, I gotta give him an F for that on the ship. Yeah, try to just reach down underneath and grab the stuff out of there instead of messing with these damn peanuts. So yeah, at this point, the best score you can get, all things considered, a C. Because he gave me fucking packing peanuts. Same water damage comics. Not all of them. Alright. What they quote is a condition. A lot of these lots like this, they don't quote a condition for that reason. It says condition good. So, yeah, that's a lie. If you got comments with the. You know, that's a lie, pretty much. You got water damage comics. Like I say, not every one of them. But we'll count them out. Let's see what we're doing with them. One, two, three, four. Wait a Starting to count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 15, 16, 18, 19, 20, 22, 3, 4, 5, 26. There's a one I've always got one in the Batman Punisher. 26, 27, 28. Nine, thirty, thirty-one, <clears throat> thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-two, five, six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-two. I may have miscounted. <clears throat> I'm gonna give it one more quick count just because it's off so many. One, two. Thank you. 
41, 42. So yeah, he, uh, that's 42 comics. Let me look in the box one more time. Make sure I didn't miss none. Probably did. three more comics so yeah <clears throat> he was accurate for the most part I don't know if I'd call it good probably most of them are good but there is a water damage comic now if I go down here and look in the description yeah it says nothing about some maybe water damage or whatnot and see I put disclaimers in mind because you can't catch every mistake or you know every uh, flaw in a comic uh, water damage is pretty obvious, but but I always put a disclaimer in my comics that way if you buy it and I miss something you can't say that I didn't you know one and then I put a, an exact scan of each comic yeah that's the best I can do really so yeah we'd say it's accurate I'll give them an A on accuracy but an F on shipping making this a C overall so not very good um, if you get a really good deal from this guy, maybe buy it from him, but <clears throat> I don't suggest it. P A R O B E R T 1. P A Robert 1. So, like I say, if you get a good deal, maybe. Um, other than that, yeah. Can't suggest them. That's a pretty big no no using uh, packing peanuts in my life. <laughs> Hate to be that way, but yeah. No way in hell I'd ever just pack a pita shipping comic. Alright, we got, and I do have some covers here that I'm pretty sure I don't have. So that's a plus. Here's Batman 445. Yeah. 445. Detective Comics 659. Okay. There's one with Lobo, Swamp Thing, and uh, right off the top. Okay, we're, Weird Worlds, number one. Maybe that's Swamp Thing. I don't know if the kids are off, but here's Martian Manhunter number two. Here's a Lobo 34. Superman Man of Steel 19. Superman 75. The Death of Superman, the actual comic. I've always had that paperback in my collection since I was a kid, but I don't think I've ever had the comic. Of course, I don't collect Superman either. Here's Superman 74. Superman Doomsday. Dark Side Battles the Superpowers, number six. There's one of the water damage ones. Looks like some of these older ones are water da the water damage ones. Here's another uh, Superpowers. Six part miniseries. That's number five. You see Jim, Son of Saturn. Number eight. Superpowers number two. Superman 78. Superman Man of Steel number 30. Justice League Annual number one. Demon number 14. The Lobo. That's a three-part series. I may keep that one in the collection, possibly. Ezreal 18. Ezreal number one. Here's the uh, Ezreal from the Battle of the Cow. A little three-part series. Ezreal Death Star at Night. Ezreal number four. Detective Comics 664. 665. 666. Here's Batman 501. Yeah, 501. 
Detective Comics 717. Batman 560. Batman the Punisher. Yeah, that's one I do want. Did want. Um, yeah, it looks like it's Azrael. The Azrael Batman. Not Bruce. Turtle Bruce Wayne 1. Which I've already got a number of those. Here's part 3. Here's an 80 page giant. Look at the draw. Number 2. We got one of the 80 page giants. Not that one though. Detective Comics 660. 617. 661. 662. It's a pretty gnarly cover. Pretty sure I don't have that one. 663. Here's the Batman Earth 1 preview. I've got a stack of those. There's another one for the stack. Uh, Bruce Wayne. Turn Bruce Wayne into a 4 of 6. 5 of 6. Now I don't think I have 5. I've got the other ones. But I don't have that one. Uh, Battle for Cal number 1, which I have. Battle for Cal number 2. Here's another one. This Jim's Son of Saturn. That's number four. See, so, yeah, not the greatest lot. I mean, there's some Batman in there, but it's not the majority. I probably spent a little bit too much on it. Like, if it, if it was less Batman than like that, typically I'd try to go for for some less than a dollar. But it's it's whatever. It'll, it'll even out in the end. Um, I'll resell the rest that I can't keep or don't want to keep. I should say. Yeah, there will be some stuff to add to the collection there, so that's always a plus. So yeah, F1 shipping, A on uh, accuracy, uh, C overall, not great, uh, you know, not horrible. He ships a pack of peanuts. I mean, come on. But yeah, I appreciate y'all checking out another uh, comic lot with me. Um, if you like this kind of content, hit like, subscribe. Comment down below. Tell me what you like, what you don't like. Um, this will probably be the last lot you'll see me open for quite a while. Um, typically, I'll jump on when they do these eBay uh, bucks promoted deals, or I have, or there's a credit card deal out there where I can get extra cash back, and I'll get on there and I'll place bids on <clears throat> on eBay and try to get uh, some lots for a decent price. Uh, you know, so until one of those deals pops up again, you probably won't see me on here doing these kind of videos. Not saying I don't want to do other comic related videos, but uh, a lot to do. I mean, y'all seen all the comics I just opened if you've been paying any attention to the channel at all. <clears throat> and uh, it's going to take a long time to process that stuff, you know what I'm saying? And uh, just a lot of other reselling stuff I got to do that's not comic related as well. So who knows when that'll be. But yeah, another one of those sales pops up. Y'all see me again. But until, the, uh, until then, y'all, I appreciate you hanging out. Take a look. Peace.